What's up guys, today we're going to talk about the Python 3 hex built-in function. So let's get a little reacquainted with uh, the hexadecimal chart. Uh, unfortunately, this one I dug up doesn't have uh, the actual integer, so just pretend on the right there was a column going from, you know, uh, 0, 1, 2, 3, all through, uh, all the way through about 25. So 0, 0, 8 is 8, 9 is 9, uh, the 10 integer is A, 11 is B, 16 is 10, etc. And then it goes down to 1A, 1B, 1C. So let's open up the shell and uh, run this, see what it looks like. Um, it starts getting funky again at 10, so 10 is A, 11 is B, 16, and I think it's a 25 where it starts getting starts getting fun. What is it again? Um, it's like 28, 29. Cool. Anyway, so uh, basically we know hex takes an integer, um, positive or negative. Um, if you try to pass a float to it, that's not going to work. If you try to pass, uh, say, a list to it, that's not going to work. Basically, we only take integers. If you were looking to add a floating point number, uh, one thing I've seen online, though I don't really know the purpose of it, is like this, uh, so you can do float.hex and you get this real long number. Again, I don't know what people use it for, uh, but apparently that's a thing. Um, another thing we could look at is um, adding, uh, using binary numbers. So you know a binary number four, oops, binary four uh, looks like this, and we can actually pass that to the hex functions we do. 0B100, and that's going to look the exact same as if we just passed a 4 to it. So again, you can pass binary numbers to the hex as well. Uh, last little hack I want to show you guys is with the format function. Uh, so say uh, we pass a number like, uh, let's say 25, and uh, we can do something fun using uh, the x argument. Um, so you might remember a normal hex with the number 25, uh, 0, x, 19, and you see how that looks the exact same. Well, we can do a couple different formats. We could do uppercase x, and you see that the x in the middle here is uppercase, or we can remove the hash completely and get a 19, and you can do that uh, with the lowercase x as well. Uh, so that's a little trick, and that is the hex function. Thanks for watching, guys.